guys, it's Tuesday morning and it's Valentine's Day! Um, I don't really have any special plans aside from going to school, going to rehearsal, coming home and studying for a huge English test I have tomorrow, but, um, yeah, so I will just start off with my outfit, sorry, I have a huge card I'm giving to Daylor behind me, I'm going to move that so I don't step on it. Face of the day is neutrals and um, I just kind of played up my eyes a little bit, I did a, um, taupe eyeshadow which really enhances the green of my eyes so I don't know I thought that was fun just because I wanted to enhance a feature that I like about myself um just you know for those days when you're not feeling 100% because I actually think I'm getting sick so that sucks um hair is just curled um yeah not a big deal I'm going to do a tutorial on how I've been curling my hair recently because it's a little different but that's to come later um outfit I just kind of wanted to play up the Valentine's Day colors. I don't own any red, so I decided to go with pink, and I really wanted to wear a skirt or something like super cute and feminine, but it is freezing, and the heat is broken at my school, I think, or at least it was yesterday. And if I'm getting sick, I just like don't want to get more sick. So, um, yeah, I'm just wearing this really big, cozy scarf, and it's from Forever 21, and I tied it into an infinity scarf. So, like, you can kind of see the tie back there. Gotta hide that better. Um, but yeah, it's just this really pretty pale pink color. And then I paired it with this taupe colored shirt from uh, Forever 21 and it has a really pretty cut out back detailing, which you cannot really see, but um, if I take off my sweater later at rehearsal then um, it'll be pretty. And then um, I also added this light pale pink cardigan from H&M and it has really pretty um, abalone kind of detailing on the buttons and I really like that. And then I'm just wearing my dark wash skinny jeans and I'm going to wear some black flats and then on my nails. I have a navy blue color to, you know, go with the mood of the day. No, I actually didn't think about Valentine's Day when I painted these. And I painted over my shellac and I don't have acetone free nail polish remover. So I can't take it off because um, I don't want to ruin my shellac manicure. So yeah, they're just going to stay navy blue. Um, it's a color by Ulta. I don't really know the name. So yeah. But then perfume of the day is Coach Poppy Perfume. The tiny bit I have left just because I love this scent and it just smells very pretty and romantic to me. So yeah, that is my outfit of the day, and I hope you all have a great Valentine's Day, and I'll see you guys tomorrow. Bye, guys. Outfit of the day, crazy fast style. I'm so late this morning. Well, I'm not late. I'm actually really early, but don't even have time. I'm going to make waffles. So, hair. First day curls, super simple. Makeup, just every day super simple. Um, outfit, I just got this shirt, and I'm in love with it. I got it at American Eagle, and it has a cutout detail on the shoulder, and then this really pretty lace and you can see it more in the back, and it's just so pretty. It's just this light cream color, has a really pretty neckline, um, and then I just tucked in the front of the shirt to my pants, and I added a braided uh, belt. The top is American Eagle. The jeans are Abercrombie & Fitch. The belt's American Eagle. Jewelry, I'm wearing my piece ring, and then this uh, kind of friendship bracelet Antonia, Danielle, and I all have, and it's from Venice Beach. So, yeah, I'm going to wear my black Nine West flats, and I'll see you all tomorrow. Bye, guys. Hey guys, so it is Thursday, and I'm doing my outfit of the day, and, um, it's another one of those I feel like dressing up kind of a days. So, uh, yeah, I'm wearing this flapper dress from a local um, costume store, so I rented it. And then this feather thing that came with it, the gold ties in. And then a pearl necklace that I got in Hawaii. And then I'm wearing my character shoes. And I have pearl earrings to match my pearl necklace. I'm going out of order, sorry. Um, yeah, it's 20s day at our school. So that's the plan. I have a tutorial on the hair and makeup for this. If you want to see how to get this look, I will link that below. And if you want to see Daly's outfit, then I'm going to link her video below too. Bye, guys. Hey, guys. It's Friday morning, and it's been kind of a weird week because it was only a three-day week. So I'm going to include an extra bonus outfit tomorrow um, because I have a formal dinner for my grade. Um, that was the grade event this semester or this quarter, um, so I'm going to include that, so stay tuned, but today is Friday, and, um, yeah, hair is what's kind of left over from yesterday, my, um, flopper girl hair, and then I just refreshed it just using my Remington, um, curling iron, it's like a clipless, uh, clipless curling iron, I refreshed it, and then I did some cute braids, I just did one on each side, um, as you can see, and then I just crossed them in the back with a bobby pin, 
to secure them and I thought that that added a nice kind of little like boho touch to my hair just because it has very like effortless um, beachy waves. I thought that was a nice addition. And then it has been super, super warm this week. Um, it was like almost 80 degrees yesterday. And so I was really excited to get to break out like my sundresses and things. Um, so today I'm wearing this really pretty sundress from Abercrombie & Fitch. Although I got it at Marshall's for, um, gosh, it was something really cheap, like $15. So a really, really good deal, but it's really pretty. I love the neckline on it. It just kind of is like a V, but it's kind of more like a sweetheart V. I don't know if you can see, um, but it's really pretty, and then it has little buttons down the front, and then a little tie, so I tied it in a bow in the back, and, um, yeah, it's, it's on the shorter end, so I'm wearing spandex underneath just because I have choir, and we don't have, like, chairs, we have risers, and when we sit on the risers, it's like, you're going to flash the world unless you wear spandex, so, yeah, spandex are a must for school, and then I'm just going to wear black flats um, for shoes because, yeah, they kind of go, and then my nails... All week have been um, a shellac French manicure. It's the second one I've gotten. If you guys want me to do a review on shellac, gel, I don't actually know what these are called. Gel, gelish shellac, uh, this stuff that I have on my fingers. If you want a review on it, I will find out the real name and I can do a review if you want. So let me know in the comments below. <sighs> yeah. Perfume of the day is going to be my Coach Poppy perfume. I'm so close to being out of it. It's such a problem. And I'll see you all tomorrow. Bye, guys. Hey guys, I promised that I would do an outfit of the night tonight, um, and I didn't actually end up wearing this, like, right when I went to the event because I had to help set it up and everything, so I ended up wearing just regular clothes, so I couldn't film an outfit of the night before I left, um, and then when I was there, I was just busy, like, hosting the event, um, so I didn't really get a chance to do an outfit of the night there, so I figured I would just do one when I got home, so if I look tired or my makeup doesn't look as good or my nose is incredibly shiny, which it really is, um, that's why, but I just curled my hair how I do it every day, um, nothing really special. I'm going to have a tutorial on this coming up in a couple weeks or so, um, whenever I get around to it, um, just because I've changed it up a little, a little and I really like it, so look out for that. Um, then for makeup, I just went pretty neutral, um, foundation and concealer everywhere, eyebrows filled in the huge. Um, I did a little bit of bronzer and a little bit of blush, and then on my eyes, I use my Sephora by Allure Beauty Editors palette, and I have a tutorial that I did on, like, Blair Waldorf inspired makeup, and it's similar to that. I just use, like, a taupe color on the lid and then a kind of green taupe in the crease. Um, so, yeah, it's, it's pretty. I like it. Um, and then jewelry, I'm wearing pearl earrings. They're my mother's. And then I'm wearing a pearl bracelet that I got when I was in Hawaii. Um, and then for the outfit, back up so you can hopefully see. What is this? This is the dress I wore. It's from uh, Urban Outfitters, and it's strapless, and it's got just kind of a sweetheart neckline, um, and then it kind of has a corset top, which I really like, and it's really pretty. It has white lace on it, so I'll give you kind of a close-up, and then you can see the, the really pretty kind of, um, I don't know, nude details it has on it, and I really, really like it, and then the back is just pretty simple. Um, it's just got kind of, like, I don't know, stuff there. <laughs> And yeah, um, that is the, the dress. And then I'm wearing nude heels, which I will take off. I'm so proud of myself. I never make it through an entire evening um, wearing, wearing heels. And I went all night wearing these. And I'm super proud. So they are by Steve Madden, and they're just nude pumps. And oh my goodness, I love these. I just got these today um, at the mall. And this dress I got yesterday at Urban Outfitters. So both of these you can still find in stores. This, I don't know the name of the shoe, but it looks like this. It has a platform, but it's not an obvious platform, um, but it's about like that high. So you take off some of the height of the heel. And these are so comfortable, so easy to walk in. Um, I set, like, I don't know, I set up stuff and I did stuff in these and I love them so much. So they're patent, um, and yeah. So that was my outfits of this two weeks. Um, I'm definitely liking doing the two weeks better, especially now that I am busy with school and stuff. Um, I think it's easier. I hope you all enjoyed, and I will talk to you all later. Bye, guys.